Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and uh, we have a little bit of tidbits of uh, what's happening with Windows. We're going to talk about Windows 10 here. We're going to talk about Windows 11 and Windows 11's future of next year. And, of course, uh, address also some people talking about Windows 12. All of that together here. So, of course, uh, Windows 11 is not even a year old officially, so it's still a brand new system pretty much. Uh, we are, of course, on the uh, track of getting 22H2, which will be the first version uh, update, the first feature update to Windows 11. We can call it Windows 11 2.0. That's coming up this fall, and that is official. Now, for 22H2 for Windows 10, a lot of people, still all the conflicts of people saying, no, no, it's not happening. Yes, it is. But what's curious is that it's still not being tested anywhere. That kind of tells us that it's probably a very, very small update. There probably ain't much in it. So they're going to be like, you know, we're going to have this, probably this surprise post someday of, oh, by the way, um, you know, 22H2 for Windows 10 is here. And um, we'll contain probably a few little things and that's it. And, and very little things. Um, if it would be a big update, we already would know because... It would already be tested. I mean, we are in June, and for a release of a new version in you know September, or October, it means it should be finished technically, and it should be being tested within the insider rings. Um, nowhere to be seen right now on any insider ring of uh, mostly the release preview where Windows 10 tests are still being done. So it's not being tested, but it's it's something that's going to happen. But don't expect anything special. Your Windows 10 operating system is going to pretty much stay the same and be the same after that update. That's coming up this fall. So, yeah, it's happening. And one last tidbit about the future of Windows 11. And, of course, the speculations that some of you are posting on the comments all the time about, well, Windows 12 is about to happen because Windows 11 is not loved. Uh, no, not ain't, ain't happening for now. Uh, Windows, there's no Windows 12 in, being worked on. Microsoft is still internally working on Windows 11. Actually, what they are doing, and we've seen um, a little info here. There's a Twitter user that found this table in the um, one of the insider previews of the Dev Channel, where you have this note, and one of them is telling us that um, you know version 688. Um, Windows 11 copper release and copper release is basically the 23H2, the version of Windows 11 next year, 2023. So what's happening is that Windows 11 Cobalt, that's the Windows 11 version that everybody's running right now on the standard um, ring. You know, if you're using Windows 11 and you're not an insider, you have what's called a Cobalt release. The nickel release is 22H2. This is what's coming up this fall. Will be, of course, a new version of Windows 11. And copper release. And by the way, the nickel release is also what's being tested in the beta channel. And the copper release, 23H2, is what's going to be next year. So they're still working, and they're working on already working on 23H2 internally at Microsoft. So we know that that's where right now we're heading. No Windows 12 for now doesn't mean Windows 12 will not exist someday. That is not what we're saying here. We're just saying right now it's not being, there's nothing being worked on that's Windows 12. Um, will there be a Windows 12? I get asked that all the time. I would not be surprised there will be a Windows 12 or a Windows, what I don't know if they're going to use numbers, but a Windows, a future Windows that's going to be after Windows 11, probably. And, of course, uh, a lot of people are like, oh, yeah, but that's going to also have, like, tons of features and tons of, of you know, minimum requirements that are going to be even heavier than Windows 11. Well, that we don't know. Uh, we have this Windows 11 with, yes, a minimum requirement that's pretty steep, but it doesn't mean Windows 12 will change that. Uh, it could. It could not. Um, but it's just speculation because we aren't there, and Windows 12 is still not a thing. So um, that's for sure. We know only that 23H2 is a thing, which is the next version of Windows 11 next year. Hopefully, with maybe a lot more improvements that people want. 
because uh, right now 22 H2 that's coming this fall doesn't really change that much Windows 11. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.